As many of you know, I am a second year student here at RIT. So as a second year student, I am able to move out to different housing options. And today I'm going to show you what Perkins is like outside. So I'm on my way to throw out trash today. So I'm gonna show you how to get to the trash bins. We have both trash and recycling here. And there's two spots to throw out trash and your recyclables around Perkins. on the left side on the further side of the perimeter near the main street around campus and this is the side that's furthest away from dorms so here we are so here we are so those are the trash bins and now I'm going to show you where the laundry is. There's only one laundry spot here, and it's also on the left side of Perkins, which is also the furthest side away from campus. So if you're on the left side, it is pretty convenient for you to be there, even though it is further away from campus because it's less of a walk to do laundry. Especially in the winter when it's cold, you only have a short walk instead of a long walk. <laughs> Now here is another special spot at RIT Perkins. This is the volleyball court. In the summertime, it is much nicer as there is less snow and it's much more green and the trees are nice. So here we are. This is the volleyball court. It's not that much of a court right now, but when summer hits or the spring hits, it is, and it's a lot nicer. There's a bunch of benches and there's also grills sometimes and picnic tables so people come out here and have a little picnic with their friends and things like that. So it's really fun out here. Earlier in the week as well, there was also a giant snowman here, which I assume has melted and has not come back. <laughs> so now I'm going to show you where the laundry building is. So after a bit of walking, I actually realized that there are more garbage can spots here. So here's another one right behind me. Behind the laundry building, there's also another one. And I believe there's actually two more on the other side, so the right side of Perkins. So there is definitely a lot of places to go throw out your trash, so yeah. And here is the laundry building. This little building here is where the actual laundry is. The bigger building over there is something else. But this is where our laundry is. Also, there is a lot of parking space all around the perimeter of the buildings. This is the biggest parking lot. This is all behind Perkins. And there's also parking lot on the sides at the ends, as well as the front where the bus stop is. Here are two more dumpster spots. And now I'm gonna walk to the bus stop. So this is what in between the apartments looks like. Some of the apartments are a little more above ground. Some of them are level with the ground. And some of them, you do have to go downstairs to get to your apartments. So the architecture of these apartments does vary from building to building. And I believe the older buildings are further away from main campus while the newer buildings are closer to main campus. If my memory serves me right. So this is what these look like. You can see that the windows are closer to the ground than the ones over there. And it is also a bit windy out here today as it is winter and we're starting to get more snow. And this is what the front of Perkins looks like. This is now against the main road. RIT main campus is back there and that's where the dorms are while that's where the other housing and apartments are as well. So as you can see, this one is one of those where you have to go downstairs to get to the apartment. But this one here, you have to go up the stairs. And now we are arriving to the main bus stop here in Perkins. So there is a bit of seating here, which is really nice, especially when you're waiting for the bus. And it's a nice little roof for when it's hot in the summer and you're trying to get away from the sun. So there's a lot of interesting little doodles here as well. <laughs> so that's the bus stop. And the other bus stop is right over there across the street. 
So there is one bus that does pass Perkins and comes to this stop only. There is only one bus that comes here, but this bus also does its rounds at the other bus stop. So if you miss your stop here, you can go right across the street and hop on again. There are also other buses like Apex, Park Point, and Jefferson that do pass this bus stop. So even if you miss the Perkins bus, if you check out the Translog app, you can track the buses where they are and you can also hop on over there. So this is continuing what the RIT Perkins Apartments area looks like. It's actually really nice, especially in the summer. It feels like a nice little community here and it's pretty homey to be here. You essentially have everything you need. You have the trash, you have the bus stop, you have like nice space outside. You also have bike racks if you ride your bike. And you also have the laundry rooms. Honestly, it's like living in your own little neighborhood sometimes, which is really nice. So there you have it. That's what the RIT apartments look like. The Perkins apartments specifically look like outside. That's the little tour. And those are the essentials here. Don't forget to check out our other videos on the RIT undergraduate YouTube channel. And also check out our Tiger Talk page, which is a blog made by students about students and about RIT. So don't forget to check it out.